Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your boy Garrett Spencer. Um, how's every how's everybody doing? Um, you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna um wanted to make this video um, you know, regarding to um, you know, you know, a person that that was not only a YouTuber but um person that was our best friend that was you know one of our friends, kind of like family, whatnot. Um, you know, of course, um, you guys um. And we also lost a person that was, uh, you know, really good to us. And, uh, of course, I'm talking about Dr. Josh the Real Gamer. Yeah, um, Dr. Josh the Real Gamer. Yeah, I can't believe that, um, that really, you know, of what happened, you know, whatnot. Um, you know, recently I was just in his, uh, his, uh, live stream, um, last, uh, Sunday or Sunday before when he did, uh, on the Nintendo GameCube or whatnot. Yeah, it was a Nintendo GameCube, um, you know, and I haven't seen him, I haven't really seen him or heard from him for a couple of days, um, I was wondering what was going on, but, um, but yeah, he, you know what I mean, like I said, he was, um, he was a good, a good dude, a, you know, one of the best gamers on YouTube, you know, I learned from, I've learned from him, he's probably learned from me by, I play, you know, I've bought in games and played games that I've never heard, ever seen before, and then, you know, he I got him buying buying some of the little games that I have bought for my uh, consoles that he didn't know about either. So we're basically learning from each other and helping each other out, whatnot. But you know, but yeah, it's you know shocking on what happened to him. And you know, I know I don't really I know I don't know him like personally because I know you know he was he's he, he was born he was born and raised in Chicago in Chicago born and raised in Chicago. You know, and, you know, like I said, just like as far as me and everybody else on YouTube, we all live in different cities and whatnot, so we never hung out or met up or what, whatever, or whatnot, so, but yeah, Dr. Josh, the grill gamer, y'all, we, we gonna miss you, man, and uh, we gonna keep our channels rolling, and we gonna keep on gaming, not just for us and everybody else, but we gonna do it for you, because I know that, I know that's what he wants, I know he wants us to keep on doing our thing, and I know he's gonna walk. He's gonna walk. He's gonna look down on us, you know. Still, you know, impressed and proud that we're still doing our thing and that you know our channels are still rolling. So, uh, you know, rest in peace, Doctor Josh, real gamer. We gonna miss you, and y'all is gonna be in our, be in our hearts and memories. So, so rest in peace, bro. But anyway, I got a package that I just received from my Brian, uh, from my boy Brian Trusty. I can't wait to see what's inside of it. I love the way he uh, drew Sonic the Hit, Sonic the Hedgehog on the back. It looks very artistic and very and very um good. You know, I want to cut it out and keep it because you know, I mean Sonic Sonic the Hedgehog was a fan of was you know I was a fan of Sonic the Hedgehog you know nearly all my life. Played it from the time I was played it from the time I was a little boy up until a grown man. But like I said, I'm probably gonna keep. I'm probably gonna somehow keep this though, so I ain't just gonna get rid of it. But um, what I received in here, voila, the Sega Genesis, the blue controller, the Sega Genesis, the blue controller, the retro um, retro game control, retro button controllers. Now I've always liked the six but I've always liked the six button controllers, you know, on the Sega Genesis, whatnot. I like. I've always liked them better than the three button controller. You know, I mean, just, um, I, you know, this is going to be my main controller from now on. And then I'm going to, the controller I've been playing on, I've been using on the Genesis. I'm going to make that my second, uh, my second controller. Well, just temporarily, but, you know, if I ever have any guests over here, a, a, any company over here one day, whatnot, you know, depending on who you are, I may let you use the other six button. I may not. I may give you the three button. I'm sorry, but that's just how that's just how it is. Now, remember when I first uh, seen the six button controller on the Genesis? You know, it was back from when I was a little boy when I was over um when I was over one of my cousins' uh, house that um one of my cousins who had the Sega Genesis itself, and this was from the time me and my cut me and my cousin was uh going to school together. Me and my cousin Bridget was going to school together. Um, yeah, my cousin Marlon. Um, you know, who I haven't seen in a long time, but you know, you know, passed away. You know, passed away as well. You know, I see. I remember seeing him using the six button controller, but it was a black six six button controller. But it looked really nice. I liked it. You know, 
never owned one myself until now but i got one but i got this one looks good it's blue just like just like sonic the hedgehog and can't wait to play it. so thank you brian trusty you the man brian but i got but hold on i got some other stuff in here too Okay, I got sci siphon filter on the place on the PS2. Now I, on the PS2. Now I have now I have a siphon now I have a um siphon filter game on the Sega Dreamcast, but it's probably different from this one. I'll probably like this one better. Now I know I'm I, you know I'm playing. I'm rolling. I'm still rolling with some gun games. I'm still just I just started playing like 24 the game that was based off a TV show whatnot. Um. You know, I know eventually I'm gonna beat that, but yeah, like I said, I can't. This game definitely looks good. I can't wait to uh, play this and try it out. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna like it. So that's one. Second for GameCube. Oh, Sp Spider Man, Spider Man the movie. Spider Man the movie. Okay, I can't wait to play this one either, cause you know. I'm already rolling with uh, Spider-Man, um, friend, foe, or friend on PS2, but this is Spider-Man the movie. Um, looks very good. Um, graphics, the graphics looks awesome, and the gameplay is also look good. So, can't wait to play. Can't wait to play that. And this one is on the GameCube, so can't wait. Another thing that's in here is on the PS2. Oh, Jackson Dexter. Jackson Dexter. Uh, look, this game I haven't haven't really played this game before either. But you know, looking at it, the graphics and gameplay looks good. Probably looks similar to Crash Bandicoot. Um, you know, um, can't wait to can't wait to play this. Can't wait to play this game either. Thanks, Brian. Also, what else we have in here? Oh shoot! He sent, oh shoot! He sent me other. NFL NFL two NFL two K. Uh, yeah, NFL two K on the Sega, Sega Dreamcast. Um, I think I may already have this. I think I might already have this one. But hey, I'll um, I'll accept I'll accept it. You know, in case if anything happens to the other one. Um, you know, I've played I played it. Um, looks really good. The gameplay and graphics are good. Makes it makes them look real, like as if you're really watching it on TV. So. Thanks, Brian. All right. What else we have? What we have here? Oh, okay. What we have here is Jurassic Park Rampage Edition. Now, Jurassic Park Rampage Edition. Um, I looked at the I looked at this gameplay up on YouTube. Uh, probably a year ago or so. Um, Doctor Josh, the real gamer. I seen him. I seen him playing this, and he seemed to have liked it. So. I had thought about getting this game, but you know, I was just too busy listening to reading other people's negative comments on it. But you know, who cares? I'm gonna I'll accept this game. Um, it looks kind of better than the regular Jurassic Park itself, you know, but it looks fun as well. So thanks, Brian. All right, got one more thing in here. Got oh okay, we got. Prime time, NFL, NFL prime time. Now, now, honestly, I'm not really, um, I'm not really, um, too big on the, uh, you know, on the football games, on the Genesis, whatnot. But, you know, because only sports games I'm really into on the Genesis is basically the, uh, basically boxing and basketball. But you know, otherwise, it looks, it looks like it seems to be, seems to be a pretty good game and whatnot. I'll probably, can, I will consider playing this eventually one day. So. You know, um, but yeah, I'll definitely um consider this and I'll accept this. So, so Brian Trusty, yeah, thanks again, bro. Like I said, you didn't really have to, you didn't really have to do this or send me, you know, all this, you know, send me this stuff or whatnot. But you know, really, really appreciate, really appreciate you, bro. Um, really appreciate you, bro. And no, we got something else in here. We got the um. We got the 8-bit art sticky note art kit. Okay, um, it's a kit for creating amazing paper pixel art on any glass surface poster boards or 
walls that are painted with flat paint. Okay, and it's the Super, Super Mario Brothers. Oh, okay, so kind of like, you know, one of these, something you can create on a poster board or a glass uh, surface, but, you know, yeah, I, yeah, okay. Definitely take this into consideration, bro. And yeah, like I said, Brian Trusty, uh, once again, Brian Trusty, thanks again, thanks again, um, Thank you again, bro. Like I said, you the man. You're very professional. You very professional on your channel, and uh, you you do very good on your channel, uh, Brian Trusty. Um, you and Doctor Josh, the real gamer, like you know, are like the best. Um, are one of the best um gamers that you know that I know on YouTube, whatnot, and you know, and so are the rest of you guys. Um, you know, I like I liked how you I like how you do your thing, Brian Trusty, and I like the way Doctor Josh did his thing. You know and you know, and how we kept each other going, how we learned from each other, and, you know, and how we just build, how we basically just build our channels together, you know, and that's the same thing you guys are helping me out with, you know, and I really appreciate, I really appreciate you, Brian. I appreciate Dr. Josh, the real gamer. Like I said, he's not gone, but he's in our heart, he's in our minds, and he's in our hearts forever, and he's watching down on us, I'm pretty sure. We're going to keep this, uh, we're going to keep the channels ro rolling. And we're gonna keep our gamings going. Be gamer. We're gonna keep being gamers, and keep doing our thing. Cause that's what we've been doing for a long time since we was kids. And we're gonna we're gonna continue to do it until we're gonna continue to keep doing it for the rest of our lives. So, like I said, um, thank you again, Brian Trusty. You didn't have to send me all, give me all this stuff, give me the stuff. But really appreciate you, bro. Thank you very much. And um. This is your boy Garrett Spencer. You guys take it easy. And I will see I will see you guys uh later on today or tomorrow. Peace and I'm out. And remember y'all, once a gamer, always a gamer. Keep on gaming, y'all.